just rigging up a black magic whiting, whiting snatcher here. Now, the whiting snatchers are great for a couple of reasons. One, you always pay a bit extra for quality, and why wouldn't you? When you come out fishing, you want to use the best possible stuff you can. Isn't that right, Wayne? Yeah, you Now, the other reason is the KL hook. Now, the KL hook is an iconic hook from Black Magic. Very good quality, Japanese steel, and a whiting killer. Now, that's the circle hook. And Black Magic have also come out with another rig called the Sandy Snatcher. Now, this is for the old school whiting fishers that like to use long shank hooks and like to really get into their fish and hook them. Now, I'll show you that one in a minute after I rig this one on. Now, you're, you're an old school whiting fisher. Yeah, you I like love, your long shanks, I love don't you? The long shanks, yeah. yeah. Now, with the circle hooks, you can actually strike on your fish, you just don't strike hard. You gently lift, when you feel them bite, you gently lift the tip of the rod up, wait for it to go bang, 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 and then reel it in. Always try and tie a loop instead of tying your main line straight to your sinker, because if you tie a loop, you can adjust the sizes as you please instead of cutting the line every five minutes. I'm ready to rock. All right, so we've got a sandy snatcher here. Now that's the long shank. Now you see that? Long shank hooks with a, a lot, nice little uh, red bit of tubing, a little glow bead, meant to re represent a sandworm, things like that, and that's what the whiting eat. We're out in beautiful Western Port today, and have a look at it. Isn't it fantastic, mate? It's absolutely beautiful. Mate. Today we come out for one mission and one mission only, to catch a feed of fish. And you're the man to do it for us, Wayne. Yeah, we will, we'll get some. We're aboard Anchors Away Fishing Charters. He launches from Stony Point. Look him up on Facebook, you'll find him. And um, hopefully we can get a few whiting, maybe some squid. Make other rods. And see what else is around. <laughs> We're getting a few bites as, as you can see. There we go. Ooh, he's on. You got him? Yeah. We got a double. Finish. And um, it's already started. So yes. sit back and enjoy. That's a, that's a King George, buddy. Yeah, he's all right. There's another one. All right, so. Look at that. No world beaters, but they're still all right to eat. How's that, folks? That's what we've come for. There's a pair of them. You're right, Mick? Yeah, mate. Yeah, you said you saw some here on the way through. Yeah, 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 yeah much, I've seen some. I think we'll go right here, actually. Yeah. I'll get a bit bigger as it drops. All right, right, there you go. Beautiful. There you go, mate. that little bloke. We'll put him up the front for That other one's got no... Yeah, I know. He's all taking the bait. So, um, here we are. Western Port. Finally get out for a fish. Pippy shell overboard for Burley. Now, with the pippies, just through the hard bit, through the green bit, then through the tail bit. And that's a nice little bait. So through the hard bit, through the green bit, through the tail bit. Here we go. Another little fella. King George Warding. I'll get a few more for dinner, eh? Oh! oh. He's got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. He's got a He's got a double header. Hold anchors away. Lift him up. Don't get a shot of that. The young bloke. There you go, buddy. Two on the anchors away. Hold that. Hold that up for us, mate. Just by the line. Double header. Hey, is that your first double header? That's his first King George Whitey, mate. Is that your first King George? <laughs> I think it's away fishing charters. Look at the camera. Hey, how's that smile? How's first that? King George double header. Now letter. I know your grandfather is going to be so jealous because he loves these fish. What? The camera. That's it. He's a good one. He's a good one. Oh, he's a nice one. That's it, buddy. Working, Nick. <clears throat> Those right. As you can see, these, uh, these whiting snatchers are definitely doing the trick. It's just been one after another. These have not stopped. We've literally been into this 15 minutes, and half of that was just tying rigs on. So we're getting some good fish, aren't we, mate? Hey? Yeah. Look at that. His first double header. Now this one. This one. <laughs> Wayne's on to another one, and I want to get my bait in the water because it's uh, while they're going red hot, you've got to get the baits going, get the rigs back in, just making them happen. All right, oh, and this one, and that one, and this one, <laughs> hold that one there, mate. Sorry, Mick, it's you right. can take that there, and I'll just bring yeah. this warding in here. All right, it is mayhem, and another one. <laughs> 
<laughs> and we haven't even got a rod in the water. Oh, no, no. That's not good. And another one. We'll get these fish onto a nice slurry. There's another one. So, Welcome um, to fishing. Yeah. Hey, but Nick. Yes, mate. It is good to uh, enjoy it. Don't just slay them. That's right. Only take what you it want to eat. To enjoy it. That's why I brought the young fella out today, mate. Yep. Uh, school holidays. Get him off Fortnite. Get him out on the whiting. That's it. Only take what you want to eat, Mick. <laughs> I want to eat all of them. Just a good fighter. Just a nice fighter. There's your orders in there again. Bait and Terrence up and... Uh, Dinner for everyone. Oh, they're going off before I can get mine back in the water. Yeah, already. Got He's it. on. <laughs> I haven't even got the pippy out of the bag yet. Are you right? Keep, keep the wrong tip up, mate. You can feel it banging, then you know it's good. Alright, come off, just wait. There's two hooks on there, so just keep the tension on the line, wind up the tension slowly. Even just keep there we go. He's on there. Yeah, there we go. You got him, mate? So he just put the tension on it. He was just mouthing that. Good work. Alright, I got this bait out there. Left him straight in, straight, straight in on the left. He's it. a nice fish. All right, so as you take this rod, I'll take this one with the fish on it for you, mate. <laughs> you can take that and catch me another one. <laughs> I can't even get another rod. Oh, I can't even get a rod in the water. <laughs> <laughs> this is ridiculous. Mick, this is, oh, this is ridiculous. This is fantastic, Wayne. This I is, can't even get another rod. This is why we come out with you, mate. Oh, he can go back. We, no, won't, we won't touch that no, little bloke. No, little guy. We won't touch him, we'll just uh, won't uh, put any acid on him. There's a reason we straight back in the water. There's a reason we choose Wayne for coming out for a fish. Now normally he runs charters, but we're just mates going for a fish today. But um, this is why. You, you absolutely nail the whiting out here, mate. He's one of the best whiting fish shows in Western Port and Port Phillip. But you do spend 90% of your time no, out here in Western Port. Yeah, 90%. Of your time. That we'll Sweeney takes the other 90 over there. Yeah, yeah, Sweeney does alright, doesn't he? Yeah, he does alright. So there's, um, there's some very good operators, and, and Wayne, Wayne's one of them, so definitely look him up if you want to get out here. Oh, we're on again. <laughs> we're on again. Just a little bit short on your cast, mate. you just got to go a little longer with your cast. Really, just get quick out there, buddy. They're getting bigger, Mick. Now, instead of just showing how many fish we're catching, which is a lot, mate, where are we fishing? Why are we fishing this area and how deep are we fishing? Uh, we're only fishing, I reckon, a metre of water, metre and a half. Mm -hmm. We're at Tortoise Head Bank. There you go, Tortoise Head Bank. We're out, we're out. No, no secrets here, this is exactly where we're at. Tortoise Head's right behind us. We're out pretty wide. Uh, yeah, in about a metre of water. But it's no secret, look, they're here one day, they're gone the next. There'll be 50 boats on it, and then when, when there's no boats, that's when you want to fish it. <laughs> if you see a lot of boats on it, just keep driving. Now we're in sand, sandy patches, there's, so there's sand, weed, sand, weed. I'm just getting hits as I'm talking. That's oh. only been in for two seconds. There we go. And you're on. Nice no, he just, just dropped it. Uh, it. Nice to get a leather jacket mix over here or something different. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind the old leather jacket, mate. They're a beautiful fish to eat. Very underrated fish, I reckon. Yeah, they are. He's right. Lift up. Don't keep whining. Don't keep whining. Now wind down. Stop. Lift up and wind down. Only wind on the way down. Step winding. Stop. And you lift him straight in. What people will do is they wind it right up here. That's no good. The fish drops. Nice little fish for you. We had a big leather jacket come up then. Those snatches are doing pretty good, Mick. Here's another one. He's on like Donkey Kong. There we go. We got something a little bit different here. Leather jacket. Elvis Presley fish, mate. Elvis Presley. We don't want him, do we? Um. Nah, it's all right. No, we don't want him. The spikes are dangerous, kids, but they're not, you're allowed to touch them and that. People say don't touch them, but yeah, they are dangerous. If they go on your leg, they won't come out because the barbs are backwards. Right there. You hear him grunting? There's the barbs. And once they go on your leg, you can't get them out. It pushes into your leg and then bang, can't come out. But we'll let him go today. Good fun, isn't it? That's great. This is what we're Absolutely doing. fantastic. On the sandy snatcher, on the long shank hook. And folks, grab him by the head. A lot of people know this, some people don't. Oh, geez, he got that right under his tongue. Really? Where did you get these? These been on steroids, these pictures. <laughs> 
Yeah, the gotcha ones. Yeah, they gotcha ones. <laughs> so um, yeah, you always grab them around the head. That's the it's this this where the scales sort of run backwards. The easiest grip point where you can actually grab a whiting. You try and grab them here in the slime. Slip straight at your hands. <laughs> 